Hello Magic players, Computerized MTG here, and here we are with the fourth match uh, with Red Deck Wimp. Uh, so yes, we will definitely want to play first. Um, this is not a terrible hand. I think this is keepable. We can cast a few things, so... Not the most aggressive deck. Uh, we don't have a discard outlet. But I'm stupid. We do. Um, I don't know what I thought Ravenous Bloodseeker did. Okay, so I take it back. This is a good hand. <laughs> I'm hoping they don't have too much removal because next turn we can swing for uh, quite some damage. Okay, so this is a black white zombie. I'm wondering if this is going to be the list that Wedge just recently put up. But, regardless, this is either white black zombie or Esper zombies. So, what we are going to do here, let's play that, I'm going to discard this, I'm going to blow that up, just so they don't start getting random uh, life, and the last thing we want is for our opponent to gain life. So that's out. Ravenous Bloodseeker is pumped. Now we cast the Bushwhacker with Surge. And we swing in for um, almost 10 points of damage. Not bad. Not bad. So. We're definitely on a good lead here. Mm. Yeah, okay, so this is just a white black zone. I mean, the, the, this guy is very annoying. So let's swing it all in and see what happens. I think that might have been a mistake. I'm hoping he only blocks with that. Okay. Let's blow that up. Oh no, I should have killed that so this doesn't die. And then that dies and it's, uh... That was not the. He's probably gonna put it on this. That way, he can't really discard. Otherwise, it dies. Yeah. So right now it's just a zero two, and if I use its ability, it'll die. Man, 
that's annoying. These fucking mummies are annoying. I think we'll be doing much better after Sideborn. such an explosive start now we're getting stumped by a bunch of fucking geezers and wrapped in toilet paper That's something. Damn, man. I think we might just have lost this first game. What the hell are they doing? Just win the damn game. Is this someone else that wants to just drag the game on forever? So let's see if we can get rid of some zombies. If he doesn't block, I th think we win here. If he blocks, okay. Okay, that's good. So we just, yeah, regardless, we just wipe this field. So we're gonna cast Fairy Temper. This dies, this dies, this dies. And we have to cast it on this. The fact that he double blocked here is annoying. So let's just cast Fiery Temper on one of these. These have to trade. So that dies. These two dies. These trade. And I'm left in a better board position. Okay. So not too bad. Really wish this, mm, this didn't get hit by that. Uh, okay, that comes down tap. It doesn't? Oh, the... Mm, the tokens it makes come down to yeah, That's a big guy. But... I really wish this was an instant speed, god damn it. Um, okay, so let's go Escalade for two. We we'll go these two. Choose the good opponent. Oh, it cost one to escalate. I thought it was this card, a card to escalate. What am I? Oh, I'm thinking, thinking of a different card. Okay, well, let's do this. That's still too big. We need to get it down to... A, we need to deal at least one more damage to it. But now at least we can kill it. Any other burn spell in our deck will kill it. And Shock is going to treat it as a combat trick pretty much. Mm. 
That's gonna get out of control fast. I really hate that fast stream, mommy. That makes it even more annoying. Okay. So black white mummies is definitely uh, interesting. This was there's the shock. <sighs> Let's see. So if I swing in with both of these, cast shock, they become two threes. Well, I'll be able to trade here, and I'll be able to get that killed. Let's see how it goes. question is so I have a couple of options here I can either make the Colossus smaller because that's going to die I guess you can put a 1-1 counter on it and trade or I kill this and then the 1-1 counter goes on it and we don't trade I get rid of that I think I killed this yeah that I can still kill that if I draw another collect to the fine so I think I killed this That way I don't trade. I mean, one of my creatures will be smaller. But I don't trade. So at least I have one creature alive and I get in for two damage. I mean, one damage. Okay, yeah, there you go. <laughs> so now we're both pretty much in top deck mode here. Why is he not attacking? Oh my god. He can outrace me. So can we push damage through? We'll wait. Because we need to cast this for Surge. If we drew a Collective Defiance here, that, that would be really good. So I'm hoping he doesn't draw anything. Man. Zombies so control get plus one, plus one. Ah, oh, man. Ah. That's not good. Are you kidding me? And I guess he's playing it safe, but... This is gonna be another match that goes on for a little bit. Even though I'm the one that's taking longer, but... So, let's put out the Bloodseeker. I still don't want to catch the Bushwhacker. I really want to draw some sort of burn and and play the bushwhacker that way I can kill something, pump my squad, swing in, or at least take a shot at lethal. Because right now I can't, I just can't get through those creatures. 
The fact that he's like taking this long with it is kind of irritating the shit out of me. I might as well throw this under the bus. It doesn't do anything. The, the creating tokens like that is crazy. We had like a small window of hope where we were gonna be able to break through, and then, ah oh man, this is the last thing they needed to top that. Come on. What is this? And there's about put two on one counter on target creature you control. Whenever another zombie control dies, we should. It's a big boy too. It's a very annoying fucking deck list. Yeah, I think this is gonna be it, honestly. It's gonna be it for game one, I think. Will you swing in with more creatures, man? God, why why do people play so safe? What am I gonna do? He knows I have one land. Well, I mean I just played it, but. I guess he's a. I don't know. I feel like he could be swinging in and not really be afraid of anything. Yeah, all I'm getting is. Yeah, those creatures are too big. Okay. So, let's go to sideboard. That's not useful. That's not useful. We're, we're bringing in the garrisons. What was key to the city, man? So we're bringing in the garrisons. We're getting rid of the small little guys that don't really do anything. So, insulinate out. So this car mage is actually not too bad since he can pump his guys up. Flame blade of death. It's good. That's good. Cartouche is good. Revenous Bloodseeker. I feel like Revenous Bloodseeker is actually not that great in this matchup. With all the little guys again minus one minus one i was left with a zero zero that did nothing i'm gonna take these out they are discard outlet though what do i take out Key to the city, the thing I take out? I gotta take something out. I'm gonna have to take these out. Let's try like that. So we do this. And we go. Where did it go? Right here. Then I think maybe we wanna bring one of these in. Move one of those. Another glory bringer. And see how it goes. Kinda go more for the mid range strategy. Okay, this is keepable, I think. A bit of a slow hand, but we have the garrison, and I really want to start swinging in with the garrison as soon as possible. Oops. And we have a lightning axe. So we can always go Lightning X, Pitch Fiery Temper, you know, so. Okay. I don't want to show this yet if I can help it. Yes. Hello. <laughs> what is going on, man? La la 
la la la la ba 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 da 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 ba da ba 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 did our opponent just die or something? Let me be a little bit coy. Say that's kind of low. All right, well, I guess I'll just sit here in silence and uh, cut back to when he comes back. Hopefully soon. Okay, so that wasn't too long. That was longer than uh, I want to wait, but that's just me, right? So we actually want to draw into lands. This guy can play on curve so well, it's annoying. He has like no draw spells, but it feels like this fool is drawing an infinite amount of cards. Like he just constantly has answers and shit. Okay, so if he doesn't play anything unlikely, uh, we can clear the board next turn and freely swing in with the garrison and that's kind of what we want we want to be able to swing in with the garrison for as off as much as possible that's annoying okay they can get menace yeah that's a new zombie lord pretty cool the zombies actually has a ton of support that's fine we'll take three Okay. So here we can go blow that up, blow that up, that can't block. Yeah. Oh, I can go one. One land short. That's a, uh, we want to start making tokens. We were one land short from using Bushwhacker. But actually, it's better. No, we don't want to use Bushwhacker yet. It's better to wait. So let's go Lightning Axe. This. So they only get one activation of that. We'll discard Fiery Temper. Oh no, I should have actually used it on that Fiery Temper. Ah, oh, whatever. I fucked up. I guess they'll get two activations out of it. Actually, do I care if he blocks? Should I just use the Bushwhacker right now? It's better to play the Bushwhacker. Yeah, I think it is. Or should we just... No. No, I, I shouldn't be playing the Bushwhacker right now. Yeah, we'll wait. I want to have... I want to be able to get more out of him. So they're gonna get smacked for five this turn. Always oh, yield. So now we're kind of back in the game. 
got rid of a lord and got rid of an annoying asshole. Yep, there's the diagraph. Put this out now. Then we wait, and next turn we meld. And we're not going to attack. Hopefully this doesn't die. This is like the only time where I'm actually happy that I'm dry land. No removal. Okay, another Colossus. That's fine, I guess. Okay, becomes a 7-4 Trample Haste. And we hold out on it still. Mm. And then next turn... The fact that those are 4-4 four, four fucks us up. It's fine, I guess. Why would you tap out my creature? And I don't get it. Do we meld right now? Does it matter? I guess. That way we have mana open to do shit. Oh, that was my turn still? Nah, I'm stupid. Oh, that doesn't matter, man. That sucks. Like zombie is pretty decent. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering when he would tap up my creature. I thought it was his turn for whatever reason. I was like, so he's tapping my shin, then he's not attacking. Oh man, I lost track of that one. He just he just keeps top decking into into stuff. Like he's not. Yeah, that's game over. That's too many zombies that he's going to get. So that's it for uh, match four, I guess, of, uh, of Red Deck when... Uh, I, that, okay, thanks for revealing me your hand, I guess. Um, yeah, that's, that's, that's the fourth match, so I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, uh, like, share, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of my upcoming content. And other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video, and have a great day.